if 2 by 3 of a is equal 75 percent of b is equal 0 0.6 of c then a is to b is to c is 2 by 3 of means multiplication into a is equal to 75 percent you will replace it with 1 by 100 okay 75 by 100 of means multiplication b 0.6 okay you can write it as 6 by 10 of multiplication cc 0.6 one digit is there now after decimal decimal okay point so you would be having 6 by 10 if you have two digits after decimal decimal means the point okay you would be having 6 by 100 6 by 100 two zeros are there no so you know after decimal you would be having two digits one two three hundred okay so it would be 1.23 after decimal you would be having two digits because we have two zeros one zero is there now after decimal you would be having one digit okay six four five seven six by ten okay one zero is there now you would be having one digit after decimal if it is hundred it would be 45.76 if it is thousand you would be having 4.576 or you can do like this 0.6 is there no you multiply and divide with 10 10 by 10 no value doesn't change so 10 into 0.6 that is 6 6 by 10 this is another way now let's simplify this further 2 by 3 into a is 75 you can write it as 25 by 3 100 25 by 4 into b 6 2 3 is a 10 2 5 is a into c 25 25 gets cancels 2 2 gets cancels 2 by 3 a is equal to 3 by b is equal to 3 by 5 c now you find out a is to b okay you bring b this side so it's a by b it's in multiplication here no it will be in division now denominator it's in numerator it will be in denominator now a by b is equal 3 by 4 into this 2 by 3 no it gets reversed 3 will be in numerator because it's in denominator here 2 will be in denominator because it's in numerator here okay so this is a 9 by 8 a is to b should be okay 9 is to 8 which option satisfies this option d from these two okay 3 3 gets cancels no b by c you bring c this side b by c is equal to 4 by 5 if you scale up it's going to be 8 by 10 no 8 is to 10 so this is our answer otherwise you can scale this down it's going to be 4 is to 5 2 4s are 2 5s are 2 2 gets cancels 4 is to 5 so yeah b by c you are having 4 by 5 and a by b you are having okay is to be as 9 is to 8 so this is our answer see i want you to be with me for ratios and proportions okay it's going to be a bit lengthier i'm explaining every nitty gritty everything every simple thing so it's going to be a bit lengthier but you know it's going to form the basis for every other chapter all these simplification techniques you need to know once this is done you will feel other chapters easy hope this is clear